We're at Copley's on Palm Canyon and we're cooking in the desert with Chef Andrew. Well, what I thought I'd do today is do you one of the dishes which kind of comes on and off the menu, um, but it's a great dish you can do at home. First of all, what I would like to do is I'm gonna show you how to make the marinade. I'm gonna take olive oil, but I'm gonna take about a three quarters of a cup, so it's a lot of oil. So as this heats up, as you can see the oil's getting a little smoky now, I'm going to add the, the ginger. Now as I spread this out, the next thing I'm gonna do is add this garlic. So I'll put the ginger in first. The garlic's already been cooked, so really one minute more doesn't make a big difference. So as we mix them together, the next thing I want to do is I've got a selection of herbs in. I've got what we call soft herbs. I've got tarragon, parsley, basil, um, chives. I can smell it. It smells amazing. And you see how the oil started to actually soak into the mix? Yep. And then I'm going to get you to give me a hand here. I'd love to. All right, now on this side, you've got some fresh clove honey, grain mustard, not Dijon, it's a grain mustard. Can you mix it. them together for me, please? Sure. So now that's ready, all I'm going to do is I'm going to tip this into here. Whisking. Whisking. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take this steak. You're going to season it with your salt and your pepper. Okay, if you want to flip that over now, we're looking for a really nice clear charred. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> and this is going to go on top. Okay, so now it's time to try the masterpiece. Absolutely. Nice and medium rare, charred on the, t on mm, the outside. Mm, mm. That is so good. Yep, I love that dish. This sauce is fantastic. Yeah, it's such a simple marinade. Your restaurant here has an amazing charm because it wasn't always a restaurant. This Talk is about a, the history of this property. This has had nine lives. I'm serious. It used to belong to Kerry Grant. It was a property he had um, it was a four bedroom property which he used to use as more of a social gathering house. And I just loved the property, the land, and I was able to kind of convert it into this, what we have today. Mm -hmm.